dark black smoke and flames billowing out of a San Jose storage facility Wednesday afternoon. Arson investigators are looking into the cause, and San Jose fire officials tell us San Jose police have arrested a person of interest. John Henry lives near the scene. He felt and heard a massive explosion that sent ash miles away. And within one second, you felt a big old jolt. I come running out to check in the living room, and we open the window, and we see nothing but a bunch of fireworks going off and we're like what's going on across the street from Henry's neighborhood Thursday the aftermath of the explosion at the public storage on Blossom Hill and Cottle Roads debris spread across the property as people came to see what happened to their units yeah antiques I've got a 130 year old piano there and that's eh, not too far from the door we were trying to move up to Sacramento area and we put everything in there just for the meantime I've seen the drone footage I've talked I talked to the chief and it's very unlikely that anything made it through. Drone View 7 video shows San Jose fire crews continuing to put out hot spots throughout the morning. SJFD Battalion Chief Brad Cluche says the two-story building with 40 to 50 units is a total loss and several of the surrounding buildings and units suffered serious damage due to flames, smoke and water. Arson investigators were unable to get onto the property until the afternoon. Chief Cluche said the cause of the fast spreading fire is under investigation. I would say that the fireworks that were going off during the fire would certainly contribute to that, um, but what actually was first, we haven't determined yet. Storage facility tenant Bryce Grennan says it's a relief to hear someone is in custody, but he says nothing can replace what he and his girlfriend lost. We're both pretty speechless. I'm trying, you know, we got to, I got to stay strong for her and help her through all this. You know, it's, yeah, that's all I can do. She's pretty distraught. And, I'm not looking forward to how my daughter is going to take everything. SJFD says it's unknown when people could get back onto the property to retrieve any items. In San Jose, Dustin Dorsey, ABC 7 News.